Hi, everyone. Welcome back to another week of virtual gymnastics. I'm Coach Caitlin. Um, today, we are focusing on our body shapes. So you guys don't need anything else um, except plenty of space for the kids to do this. Um, make sure that there's room around you so you don't get hurt. Um, and make sure you guys have plenty of room so when we practice our forward rolls and things from previous weeks that you're not going to hit anything. We're going to start with our warm-up song. So I'm going to have you guys stand up tall. Nice jump. We're going to sit and let me see your butterfly stretch. So feet together. Can we flap our wings? We'll go fast. Fast. Can you go slow? Can you smell your toes? Do they smell good or they smell stinky? Are they good or are they stinky? Nice jump, ready, legs up. Do you remember what this is called? This is our straddle. So we want straight knees, right? Don't bring them up, we want them nice and flat. When we reach up, can we clap four times? You ready? One, two, three, four. And we'll reach down and try and touch your toes. With straight knees, reach all the way down. Nice jump. Can we reach up and clap six times, you ready? One, two, three, four, five, six. And we'll reach down, we'll touch the other side. With straight knees. Try and reach all the way down. Nice job. Can we take our fingers and walk them up to the middle as far as you can without lifting your bum off the ground? Let me see. Very good. Can we put our legs together? We'll do our pike stretch with what kind of toes are these? Do you remember? Our pointed toes. What about flexed toes? Can you do your flexed toes and walk your fingers all the way down and touch your flexed toes? Nice job. And we'll do pointed toes. Can we touch them 10 times? So reach up. I want you guys to count with me, okay? You ready? One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice job. Can we lift one leg up to the sky? We can draw a picture. What should we draw today? We want to draw a fish or a flower or a mermaid. Or a dinosaur. And once you're all done, hug this knee. 
Give it a big squeeze, hug it nice and tight. Nice jump. Can we do our other foot? With this foot, can you color in what you just drew? So what color should we use? I'm going to use blue and green. Nice job. And once you're done, hug this knee. Big squeeze. And we'll do crisscross applesauce. And can you put your hands together? And we'll roll them. Go fast. Can you go slow? And Jacob, you go up high. And down low. And behind your back. And way out in front of you. And we'll do one hand high, one hand low. And can you switch up? Can you do two high? What about out to the sides? And one hand in front of you and one behind you. And switch them. And switch them. And switch them. And freeze. Good job. Can you show me your table? So two feet in front. Push your belly up. We'll do one foot. Could you do your own foot? This time, can you put one foot over the other? We'll put your ankle on your knee. That one's tough. Can you try your other foot? Good job. And once you're done, we'll come down. We're going to do three rock and rolls. So we're going to hug our knees nice and tight. Don't let go. Make sure there's plenty of room so you don't hit anything. You ready? One. Two. And we'll do one more. Ready? Three. And this time when you do a table, can you do one hand? But can you wave? Can you wave your other hand? Good job. And this time, can we try and do straight leg rock and rolls? So make sure there's plenty of room behind you. And put your legs out like our pike stretch. And hands up. We're going to try and kick this guy, okay? Ready? Go up. That was one. Can you do two more? Two. Ready? One more. And three. Good job. All right. Can you stand up tall? And we're going to get a quick drink of water before we play our game. All right. You ready? We're going to play a game. So I'm going to say something and we have to pretend to do that. All right. So we're going to start. Do you think we can do a big jump like we're going to do a cannonball into the pool? So we're going to stand up. Do you know how to do a cannonball into the pool? When we jump, you got to jump and grab our knees, right? We want to do two knees. You ready? You got to yell cannonball too. Ready? One, two, three. Cannonball. Nice job. Do you think we can march? And we're going to pretend to play a drum like we're in a band. So let me see. Can you march? And let me see. Can you play a drum with your hands? So bring those knees up and let me see. Pretend like you're banging on a drum. Can you go faster? Nice job. Do you think we can pretend to be popcorn that's popping? So get down super low like you're a popcorn. It's called a kernel. Ready? We're going to do a big jump like popcorn does while it's popping. Ready? Set. Go. Go. Nice job. That was some big popcorn. All right. Now, do you think we can pretend that there's balloons on the ceiling? And we have to try and grab them all down. All right. So pretend there's all sorts of balloons up here. We're going to use our hands. We're going to pull them down as fast as we can, okay? You ready? So hands up. Ready, set, go. Grab your balloons. Grab as many as you can. Grab them. You got to get them before they fold back up. Go fast. Fast, fast, fast. Oh, nice job. Did you get all of your balloons? Yeah. All right. One more. Do you think we can pretend that there's a bear behind us? 
and we gotta stay where we are. But we gotta run as fast as we can so the bear doesn't get us, okay? You ready? Set, go, run, so the bear doesn't get you. Run, you gotta go fast. And we're safe. Good job. Were those fun? All right, so we're gonna do our forward roll and our jumps and our cartwheel or in our handstand and our balance beam like we did the last couple weeks. So we'll go those really quick, okay? So can you stand up and show me your forward roll? So stand nice and tall, right? Where do my hands start? Good, we go way up. And then can we touch the ground? And do I wanna look way up when I touch the ground? Or should I look down at my belly? There you go. Look all the way down to your belly. And let me see you roll all by yourself. Very good. What about our balance beam? Do you think we can walk forwards? So when we walk, we wanna put one foot in front of the other, right? So our toes touch the back of our foot. So we're gonna go forwards first, you ready? And you walk forwards, one foot in front of the other. You put your hands out like you're flying, like an airplane. And then once you're there, we'll turn around and can we go all the way back? There we go. Now we're gonna go sideways. Do you remember your legs go open and then close? So can you do open and close, open and close, open and close, and we'll go all the way back, ready? Open and close, open and close, close. Very good, can we turn around? We'll do the same thing back. Open and close. Open and close, and we'll go all the way back, the other way. Very good. Do you think we can go backwards this time? So just like we did forwards, we'll put one foot in front of the other. We'll put our hands out like we're an airplane. Very good. And we'll turn around. Can you go all the way back? One foot in front of the other. We're arms out like we're an airplane. Nice job. All right. What about our jumps? Do you remember our jumps? Can we try and do a straddle jump? So can you do open and close? Can you go faster? Ready, open, close. And now you remember we do it all together, right? So we don't touch our feet on the outside. So make sure you have plenty of rooms, you don't kick anything. And we'll do open and close. Good job. What about our tuck jumps? So this is kind of like we just did when we were jumping in the pool, right? Pretending like we were a cannonball. So we're gonna bring our knees up to our belly. And let me see, we'll land back on our feet. You ready? Set, go, tuck jumps. Nice job. What about our straight jumps? So our hands go up, we're gonna try and touch the sky. Nice job, can we do two more of those? Ready? Nice job. And do you remember the new jump that we learned? Oh, and our spin jumps, right? Let me see, can you do your spin jump? So I'm gonna jump and try and spin all the way around. Nice jump. All right, now do you remember the new one? So we do one foot forward and one foot back, remember? Our split jump. And then together. So one foot goes forward and the other foot goes back. And then jump with them together. Can you go out and back in? There you go. Can you do it again? And back in. And now we're gonna try and go fast, just like we did in our straddle jump. So try not to touch the ground on the outsides. Ready, set, go. Nice job. All right, one more thing before we start our, our new skills. Do you remember our handstand? So where do my hands go? Up. Right, and we push so our elbows cover with our ears. And then what do I do? We do one foot forward in our lunge. 
and then our hands go down and can you kick one foot up to the sky and then we'll come right back to where we were. Make sure you don't kick anything. So ready? Hands up, feet together. You'll do one step forward and lunge. And then you're gonna hands down and right back up. Do you think this time we can do two feet to the sky? So hands up. One foot forward. We'll do one lunge. Hands down and can you kick two feet up to the sky? And then stand right back up. Nice job. All right, so now we're going to practice some body positions, okay? So we're going to start with something that you guys already know. So can we do our straddle? So our legs go out, right? And can we sit up nice and tall? So try and make your back nice and straight with straight knees, right? And can you point your toes at the end? And we're going to put our hands out in front of us. So as tall as you can, try and make your hands right next to each other. Nice job. Do you think we can do this on your back? So we're gonna lay on our back and our legs go up. Then we go out like our straddle. And can you put your hands up? Just like this. Nice job. What about our pike? Can you do your pike? So our toes are pointed on this one, okay? We're not gonna flex them yet. Can you point your toes with our feet together and our knees nice and straight? And remember, we wanna have a tall back. We don't wanna slouch down like this. Can you be tall? And we're gonna put our hands up the same way. Nice job. Do you think we can do that on our back? So we'll put our legs up to the sky. And we'll put our hands up to the sky. And your back is going to be nice and flat on the ground. Nice job. What about our tuck? Do you think you can do like the beginning of your rock and roll? So we hug our knees, right? Hug it nice and tight. You're good. Do you think you can do it this with your hands on the outside? Nice job. And do you think we can do it on your back? So you're gonna lay down. And we're gonna make a ball on the floor. Very good. All right, now can we stand up tall? Do you think we can stand like a flamingo? So remember we put one foot up. Just like a flamingo. Good job, what about the other foot? Do you think we can do it with your hands above your head? We'll try your other foot. Nice job. Do you think we can do this? Just like we did before we do our handstand, right? We did this a couple weeks ago. With our hands out, we're gonna do one leg nice and straight. So make that leg nice and straight. And the other one's gonna go behind you nice and straight. So should you look just like this. So one foot straight. This one's out, we're gonna put our hands out. And we're gonna try it on both feet. Nice job. Now, do you think we can do it with a bent leg? So this leg that's down on the ground is gonna be bent. So can you bend it? And we'll put this foot behind you. And we'll put our hands out straight. This one looks just like the one we did, right? So this is called arabesque. Can you bend that knee? So this knee's going to be bent. Move our hands out in front of us. And we want our foot that's not on the ground to be nice and straight. Nice job. Do you remember what we do when we jump? So we jump. And then do you remember we stick it? Ready? So we're going to do a jump. And stick it so our knees are bent. And our hands are out, right? And then what do we do after that? So we jump. And we stick it, and then our hands go up, right? Do you think we can do that one again? Ready? Jump, stick it, hands up tall. Nice job. All right, now we're gonna practice. Ready? So hands up. We're just gonna point your toe, just a little bit. So you can leave it on the floor. With our hands up. And we'll do your other foot. So point your toe, 
So just your toe is on the floor. Do you think you can do that? And then we're gonna try and lift it. And we'll do your other foot. So start with your toe on the floor. Then lift it way up high. Nice job. And do you think we can get back on the ground? And we're gonna do this. So can you push nice and strong into the ground? There you go, ready? So we're gonna have our strong arms so they're nice and straight, but you gotta push, remember? So our back goes nice and round. And do you think you can go the other way? Can you make your back round the other way? And we'll go up and down. Do one more, push up and down. Nice job, do you think we can do that? But we're going to try and put our feet behind us. So we're going to do strong arms. We're going to put one foot behind you. We're going to put the other foot behind you. And can we count to five? You ready? One, two, three, four, five. Nice job. And we'll do one more. We're going to pretend like we're Superman. All right? So can you lay on the floor on your belly? And we're gonna lift our legs and we're gonna lift our arms. So just your belly's gonna be on the floor. So hands up, legs up. I'm gonna come to three. Ready? One, two, three. Nice job. All right. That is all we have for you guys this week, but we'll see you next week and we hope to see you in the gym soon.